Hello everyone, it's DA here and today we're going to be taking a look at Warframe Augment mods as a whole and how to effectively pick the best for any occasion. First thing to know is that Augment mods are like river mods for Warframes. While some see it as a way to create versatility and multiple variations of playing each frame, there are also others who see this as an opportunity for the devs to bypass obvious problems with each frame. These mods can also be acquired through Syndicate Reputation or Trade Chat with Platinum. There are 100 Augment mods in the game for PvE, 32 frames and soon to be 33. In basic math, we have an average of 3 mods per frame, but then every frame doesn't have one. So solving this decisive issue can be quite complicated for a new player or annoying to veteran players. Do you use 1? Do you use 2? Do you use 3? And if all, how do you pick them? Warframe Augment mods, in my opinion, can be grouped into 5 categories. Alternate damage, alternate defense, crowd control, utility, and fun. To identify them, you need to know and understand the frame itself. Know its strengths and weaknesses, then examine your disadvantages in every single mission. Note that this perspective will change as you grow with the game and as you rack up because you are becoming more of a veteran over time. After fully understanding this, start looking at the benefits of each augment mod itself. You might not need it as you might only need to sacrifice or actually do something that will cost you maybe a former or two. Look at your mod slot as you only have 8 basic ones. Never sacrifice your essential mods for an augment mod unless you think it through. In this example, I am using an energy vampire trinity. In this basic build, the goal is to give your squad mates some energy. But in a dire situation, the team also needs more protection. Vampire Leech will be the logical choice as you are able to give them over shields while you are also giving them some energy. This is the kind of scenarios, situations and cases that you will come across in a lot of your missions and a lot of the games that you play and before you spread your hard earned syndicate reputation or your hard earned plats, you must know if the benefit outweighs the cost. So why did I do this video? Why this video you ask? Well, the Warframe community is growing daily and there are players with questions that need answers and a lot of them are going on YouTube and going from video to video trying to see if they can find an in-depth understanding or in-depth explanation of these issues. So thank you very much for watching. Feel free to leave comments below that could help or would help other players or a lot of new players in the game and also add to the content of the video. Subscribe to the channel for Warframe related content such as updates, news and explanations. As always, it is DS signing out. I'll see you guys in the next one.